So this morning we are just bringing around the log cabin. The concrete slab at the back has dried completely, so we're ready to rock and roll. So yeah, let's just hope today the weather's kind to us. But these are the French doors. There's one, the two windows, and there's the other French door. And as I said to you on Friday, it comes with a four-point locking system. The units are double, gla um, yeah, double glazed. So yeah, really excited. So now we've managed to get our um, foundations at the bottom down. It's gone together like an absolute dream, hasn't it, Luke? Yeah. It's been so easy to lock together. Um, so I'm hoping with a bit of luck that we might actually get the whole thing built today. But so far, so good. Just wanted to jump on here and give you guys just a little bit of a tip so you will get with the cabin these packing, packing pieces don't chuck them keep them because the higher you go the more chance you've got of having to give the cabin a little bit of persuasion so all that you do is you interlock it into the existing cabin and then you just hammer it down and then it slots in so it's nice and sturdy so yeah don't chuck these keep them so we've nearly got it up I would say it's taken about two and a half hours, maybe three, but we should most definitely have this up by the end of today. Ow. So I've come in to make the tea and look, it's nearly up. It looks really good. Still got quite a lot of wood though, but not bad for 11 o'clock. We've been on it for about two hours now and uh, yeah, it's looking really good. So we've now got the French doors on. And I have to say, it is looking epic. Really easy to put together. You're probably saving yourself the best part of two grand, I would say, having looked at other lockers for actually doing it yourself. And, you know, me and Luke haven't built anything like this before. And it's been relatively straightforward. We started at nine o'clock today. So it's not taken us that long. I appreciate we still got to get the roof on and the flooring inside down but it's been an absolute dream to put up. So definitely well worth considering if you are looking to get a summer house, a cabin, whatever it is, go check out Dunster Homes. Cabin update. So we've nearly got the roof, or I think we've got the roof on actually. I just popped to the supermarket. How depressing was that? Literally nothing on the shelves whatsoever. But anyway, how incredible does our cabin look? really happy with it we're going to get the felt on um so that it's completely watertight and then we can make a start on the floor look at that if we can do it you can he's still up there love him nearly finished meanwhile i remembered that we had some cedar cladding left over from when we did the back of the house so we're going to be putting some of it on the front so it's going to be white Amphysite grey windows, uh, French doors, some cedar cladding, which I'm going to stain or put the oil on it so it, it keeps its colour like ours has done on the house. And then it's going to be like a little mini bungalow. Hi guys, so Luke has packed up for the day. As you can see, she is up, she looks beautiful. Um, with any luck, I'm going to be painting the cabin each evening when I get home from work. We have got so many direct messages. We will do our utmost to get back to you all of this, all of you this evening. Um, we've just been, hello my pooch. Hello. That's Hoochie, that's the eldest one. Here comes Elvis. Um, so yeah, we're going to come back to you this evening with any luck. We've just been out there all blooming day, but we are there or thereabouts in all fairness. So we just need to go and get some paint. 